friends, welcome back to my channel. Guess what I just got? <laughs> I just got my December kit from Wild Hair Kits and I'm super, super excited. I'm gonna open it up. I've already opened it, but I have not looked inside. So I'm gonna open it up and show you guys what I got for the month of December to play with um, and create with. <gasps> oh, mm. yes. <laughs> okay, so I got a deluxe kit this month. Um, let's see, put you up there. So, let's go ahead and pull everything out here. Here's my little order form. It says, let's see, let's move it around this way. Okay. It says, hope you love your December kit. I sent tons of 12 by 12 wood grain papers along with everything we have from the Saturday afternoon collection. I also mixed in some pieces from Pink Fresh Studios, Office Hours, and Cartabella's Flower Market collections, along with your December cut file. I did send a wood veneer set that is missing the why and happy because I think there are enough other great usable pieces. I hope that that's okay. And of course it's okay, <laughs> um, which she's talking about this right here. Um, there are several really great other pieces, and I can use, the. It, I think it was supposed to say choose happy, um, but I can use choose, and I can use thickers, or yeah, I can use these, like, we're all good here. Um, so, for my style profile for this month, I actually asked for some of the Saturday afternoon, um, because I never got any of it when it came out, um, and I like the rose gold foil, and um, I already had... What was it? The crepe paper snowflake collection. I already got that. Um, so I didn't want to get that in my kit. So you can specifically ask her for things. And if she has it, she'll put it in your kit. So that's really fun as well. Um, and then my little card here. And it says, hi, Heather. Happy December creating Allison. So let's go ahead and just jump in with things that are on top. So let's start with this. This is the Fabric Ephemera um, from Office Hours from Pink Fresh Studio. And here are the pieces that you get in them. And I already see the Need More Coffee is totally up my alley. Um, lots of great little sayings. Be positive. Let's do this. Daily grind. Do it like a boss. Um productive, small steps every day, and follow your dreams. Like these are really great um, pieces. And I like that they're fabric because they're gonna add like a different type of texture, um, which is always nice. Next up, we have rub-ons, which, okay. Um, they're, are they rose gold? They're really pretty. Okay, so here's what you get in these. And I love rub-ons. Um, they're for sure something that I used to use like when I first started scrapbooking a lot and then I kind of just stopped buying them and here recently I have had I think I've had them in another kit and I really really enjoyed them so I'm glad she sent those to me these are from Saturday afternoon one canoe two and they are the wood stickers and they are really really cute life is a collection of moments that is really adorable Love the little camera and the flowers. Um, and the little house is really cute. And then we'll go with these. <laughs> Here are the thickers from the Saturday afternoon collection. Um, and I just really love the foil because your girl loves some gold foil or rose gold foil. Even the little house has the foiling on it. It's so cute. Look at the little sweet tea with the mason jar. Um, some of this stuff reminds me of like summertime. Like when I think of, I don't know, sweet tea and like popsicles, I know that I think of summertime, but an ice cream, you don't necessarily have to use summertime pictures or I can scrapbook summer and winter. Who cares? It's whatever I feel like, right? <laughs> okay. So she also sent me six by eight paper pad, um, 
And there's actually quite a bit in here, y'all. So here we go. I'll do a quick flip through. I love this one. And I love cut aparts, of course, like this one. Cute. Some really, really pretty patterns. I don't know about the avocados, but um, everything else is really pretty. All right. Next up, she sent the chipboard stickers from the flower market from Cardabella, which is perfect. This really does match very well. Some really cute pieces. Love the flowers, the little sign, the bow and the hearts. Really, really great pieces. Okay. And then she also sent me the Saturday afternoon one canoe two stickers. Dear Saturday, I love you. I think that's so cute. And then this is the back. Got lots of like tiny word stickers down here and some little borders. We have the avocados, which, you know, I'm not really sure about, but I like avocados, so, you know, um, really, really cute little elements. All right, so I know she said she sent the cut file, so let me see if I can pull that out, which is probably something that I probably won't use with this kit um, necessarily, but I'll probably, I'll, I'll definitely keep it and use it um, for something else. And it says, oh, dear. <laughs> and it's a deer. <laughs> it's cute. So, there is that. It's adorable. Stick him right up here. And we'll go ahead and flip through the papers. Um, and y'all, if you've never had Cardabella paper, go get you some. Go get you some Cardabella paper right now and just touch it. Because it is so it's such nice paper. It is my favorite paper. Like it's textured, it's smooth, it's thick. I love it. Um, I love Cardabella's papers. <sighs> they make me so happy. Um, so here we have little tiny cut aparts. Super, super cute. And then the back of this is really, really pretty as well. Um, it's like a, I don't even know what kind of color it is, not coral. It's a pink, it's a light pink um, with little bouquets. All right guys, <laughs> my video got cut off. I filmed the whole video and then realized that it stopped at this paper. So, <laughs> let's go back through. We already did this piece. So next up we have this watercolor floral, which is also from the flower market collection from Cardabella. And here is the back side of that, which is a cream and black stripe. And then next up we have this one from Pink Paisley Indigo and Ivy. And this is the side that I'm definitely going to need to use. Um, this is the opposite side, which is great. It's wood grain and it's like a parquet wood grain. But uh, there's so many wood grains in this collection or in this kit that I really, really like this one. I think this will look great with some wood grain. And then we have, this is from um, the Heidi Swap Wolfpack collection. So I definitely will not be using this side. Um, definitely going to be using it for the wood grain. This one is from the Wolfpack collection as well. And this one looks like the, the um, trunk of a tree, but just zoomed in. Um, and I really, really like this one. I could definitely see myself using this side as well. Um, but probably going to use this one. Um, and I don't know if I said, but I did ask for wood grain. So um, that is why she sent me all the wood grain. Because I love wood grain. I love all of the wood grain. This one is from the Wolfpack collection as well, which is super funny. Um, Heidi Swap had all of these wood grains in one collection. Um, but this side is a really great side too. So I'm not sure which side I will use yet, but I do like both sides. And then we have another one from Cardabella Flower Market, which is a perfect wood grain. It's really, really tiny, narrow boards. And then this side is also really cute with all of the little embroidery um, hoops. 
And then the last paper is another Heidi Swap, but this is from her Winter Wonderland collection, which I believe is her new Christmas collection. And so here's the opposite side, which I probably won't use because the red doesn't really match with anything um, from this collection. So I'll definitely be using this side. So I have lots of great pieces to work with this month. I'm very excited about all my wood grain. Some people would look at this and be like, oh my God, what are you gonna do with all that wood grain? Y'all, I don't know, but we're gonna figure it out because I'm very excited. I love wood grain so, so much. But you also have to think that I have these papers to coordinate with the wood grains, but I also have all of these six by eight papers, which are going to coordinate perfectly. So I'm very excited to be working with this kit for the month of December. I know it's a little unusual um, to be working with kind of more of a spring and summer kit um, in winter, but I think it'll be fun. And I'm very excited to play with all of these goodies for the month of December. So um, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not already a subscriber so you guys can see what I come up with this month <laughs> um, with the kit. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to spread love and be kind. I hope that you all have an amazing day.